All right, it is a chilly start. A lot of 30s still on the map. 36 at BWI, 37 in Jaredsville, and 37 in Westminster. And temperatures were actually a couple degrees colder just a few hours ago, so it's certainly possible that frost has already formed on the car windshields on your lawn outdoors. And we're even still cold enough for that around Gaithersburg and Frederick. Wow, what a chilly temperature there. I'm not sure if I've seen many 20s on the map so far this season. 28 degrees are currently checking in there in Frederick. 39 in Easton. Even on the eastern shore, frost is possible. So it's very chilly to start. The sun will come up. Uh, just around 645 this morning, so as poles open, the sun is shining, but we're still in the 30s. By noon, though, 59 degrees as the uh, sun is setting at 5 p.m., we fall back through the 60s. We should end up with high temperatures around 66 in Baltimore. That's probably around 3 p.m., so if you want to get out in the warmest part of the day, that's the time to head to the poles. 66 for Hagerstown, 61 in Oakland, and uh, Easton at 66 degrees. Sunshine all across the state. That changes tonight as clouds build into the area. That's with the cold front approaching tomorrow. This one, a weaker front, a stronger one around. Uh, over the weekend, but this one will at least produce a few rain showers. So even by Wednesday morning, heading back to work, we'll likely see some rain showers on the commute. A few more showers could last into lunch, maybe even for the early afternoon. But it's a quick mover. Futurecast here shows the rain clearing out even by 3 p.m. And then as the skies clear Wednesday night, it should turn out a lot colder. So if one wave of cool air arrives Wednesday into Thursday, a next batch of colder air into the weekend. This is the kind of setup here with that cold air pouring over the Great Lakes. It can produce some sprinkles around here, maybe even some some flurries in spots out towards Western Maryland and Pennsylvania. Those seem like the most likely areas. We'll keep an eye on it. Until then, we have warm temperatures today. The cool down starts tomorrow. Showers on Wednesday. Thursday looks sunny. Friday looks dry for Veterans Day, but that cold air pours in Friday into Saturday. Saturday may not get out of the 40s.